Okay. It's time for the day, and today we're going to talk about what's in this eBay package. So let's get started. So as I said, we're going to be talking about what's in this eBay package. So you don't know what's in here, do no, you? No, I don't. I didn't know you're getting a package from eBay. So. So let's yeah. see. Can I see. Do you think there's a pop in here? Uh, could, I don't know. Does it look like a pop will fit in this box? It looks like it. No, 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 not at all. It's not a pop. Calm down, boy. What do you think it is? Be anything. That size. Maybe if you just showed me what it Close is. Close your eyes and feel it. See what you think it is. Don't look. I open it up and I'll let you I feel it. Something. See, close your eyes, feel it, see if you can guess what it is. I can feel the face. This is Tony Tiger. I can feel it. I can feel his face. I can feel the face. So, what this is, is. I'll take Tony Tiger. I don't know. See, the listing that I bought it from, and it didn't come from China. Which it could have just been somebody bought it from China and they're reselling it. It said that it was a scrapped Tony the Tiger, which means that it didn't pass quality control. So the paints probably got something wrong with it and you know, stuff like that. And he in in the listing he showed comparisons from Regular. this one and the china versions so i just ordered it because it was only twenty dollars so i ordered it just to see if it how fake it was or anything like that so we're going to compare it to this one since we don't have the real one <laughs> we'll just compare it to this one. Real one you probably ain't watching the channel if you watch the channel you know we got which the inch one i already seen one. that there was some paint flaws on it what's them i can't oh like the face the paint's like it's not like different kind. Some tiger. But they feel about the same weight. They do. The nose is a little bit oh. different, and the and the overall color oh, is yeah. a, the the overall color is a little different. Can you tell that? Oh yeah, you can. So. But I mean, the material and stuff feels about the same. So. Let me put a box up here. Maybe it'll focus better. I mean, so now definitely on camera, you can tell they're a different color. They're not that different in person, yeah. but they feel about the same weight. <laughs> like pretty you much. You see the stripes are a little different on the head. Oh yeah. It's like thicker on this one. The well, the Let's real check one. the feet out. Wait, do you think the regular Tony Tiger is different than the sunglasses one? I don't know. Maybe the paint's like more orange on the regular, no matter what. Maybe it's not. I mean, it's weird. stamped with Funko, the same on the feet and everything. Okay, let's see. Yeah. So, so another thing that I've always heard to look out for with fakes is a lot of fakes, the white part around that will be different. If you see what I'm talking about. See the white part around the character that goes up through here and around the top of the head. I've always heard to look out for that on fakes because they don't cut the boxes the same. But this right here is a real one that we found in store. And then this is a real one that we found in store at- The uh, white looks different. Where'd you find that one at? Game you got that one at GameStop. So look at, the, look at the difference around this one. See how thin the white is? Look, compare the two. What? So it's on fake? It, you bought it at GameStop, so I mean, I don't know why they, I don't know how GameStop would get a fake pop, but I mean, I guess they could. Oh, I just realized something about the Tony Tiger. His hair's like sideways. Was that just, yeah, kind of just messed mm -hmm. up. His hair's like sideways. So I don't know. I mean, compared to a lot of the fake pops that I've seen, this one's pretty good. I mean, everything's the exact same size. Well, like I said, the color is a little different. The paint, like it's thicker, some, some of the, like the stripes. There's not like a crazy amount of glue or anything that's off. Yeah. And it's not like any crazy differences. No. If you put it on a shelf. If you just seen this one by itself and then seen this one by yeah. itself, you wouldn't know. But if you look at me, maybe the regular is the orangest. And then the one with sunglasses is actually looking like this different color. Okay. So we'll show them off again. See which one do you think looks better. 
Well, we don't have the regular to compare. No. We just have this regular. Yeah. Well, not really. The most regular. To me, I see more paint flaws on the the Hollywood one where his nose has got a paint flaw on it. Right over here somewhere. Yeah. And, uh... I don't know. I mean, all the way around, it looks, if it's a fake, it looks good. But what the listing said was, <gasps> uh oh, the listing said it was a, just a scrapped okay? one that they, you know, that they couldn't sell because, oh. because of uh, stuff was wrong with it. So I don't know. Yeah. On camera, on camera, it looks like two totally different colors, but in person, it's not that, it's not that noticeable. Yeah. So if you ever, and you see like, you might so just look out for your Frank Fungo pops. Some they are like bad toys sometimes. Yeah, like some of them are really hands. squishy this and stuff. Squishy. No, this one, these two. If you close your eyes, these two feel the exact same, mm -hmm. same weight and everything. There's not as many stripes. I feel like on this one. Wait, how many stripes does he have? Hmm? I feel like he has less stripes, or are they just thicker. They're just thinner and thicker. Okay. So. All right. Still recording. All right, finish your video up here. Okay, so make sure you like, comment, subscribe, do all that. So make sure you don't find any fake Funko Pops and go out and buy a bunch of them. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe, do all that to another stack of pops. Or let us know how you find fake Funko Pops if yeah. you've bought a fake Funko Pop. Because we've been at shows and I've seen some. I've seen some that I were pretty sure were fake. But just let us know some of the tips that you go by to find fake ones. Because, I mean, we've never... I've never bought any that I thought was fake, but who knows? I might have some that are fake, like this one. Who knows? Yeah. It could be fake. It could be totally fake. For $20, it's a good fake, though. Yeah. Looks good. It could not be fake. Okay, so make sure you like, home, subscribe, do all that. It's another episode of Stack Pops by Popsters.